Thank you for watching my YouTube channel, IT Howcast. My name is Rahat Iqbal. Today I'm going to show you how to activate Office 365, Office 2016 subscription. So if you have it, Office 2013 is going to be on the same stamp. There is no big difference. So let's start it. So what you need to do, you need to launch first any Office application, which could be your Office uh, Word 2016, Excel, Outlook, PowerPoint, you know, like anything you like it. So once you launch it, you should see uh, activation Office dialog box. It's going to ask you, go ahead and enter your email address or, you know, like uh, your phone number, which is, uh, associate with your subscription so what does that mean uh, when you buy your subscription uh, they give you you registered it using your um, like your hotmail account or yahoo account or gmail account or msn account or any other account right so once you register it they send you a link and you may have it in there is something called product key product ID key and you can punch in and then you can activate it but right now what I'm doing it I just want to activate my uh, office 365 using my uh, user ID or my email address right so in this case I just launch it word 2016 and this one this dialog box pops up is called activate office I'm going to go to the next slide and what I'm doing it over here I'm just typing my it howcast at gmail.com this is the email address I use it when I purchase office 365 subscription and sometime what happened um, if you don't have it let's say for example internet access uh, they provide you some kind of a product ID code and you can type it and you say next but this one is more simpler if you uh, just type it I, I your email address and then um, is behind the scene is going to connect to the Microsoft site and then try to authenticate and once your once you authenticate properly your office 365 is uh, activated so I just typed it and then about within about like 10 seconds I get this new dialog box is called account updated this computer has been added to your computer sorry to your account so if you get any type of error sometimes you say oops something wrong you get any type of error just make sure you check your internet setting might be your Wi-Fi is not connected or your internet is not connected if everything is working fine you should not have it a problem it should not take more than five to ten seconds so the other question is that you know once your account your office 365 subscription is activated you want to just verify that hey is this really activated and how to check it and so on so you can go to your web browser and then type it HTTPS portal.office.com and then it's going to ask you your username and password so you're going to use the same username and password you use it in uh, you purchasing office 365 subscription and you click OK and you're going to see something screen like this I have it here and in there you find it something called install status and you can see under install status it's a computer name IT Howcast right so this is just giving you a status that I successfully verified and installed my office 365 subscription on this computer so you can manage your your subscription on the PC or a Mac and the good thing about this subscription that once you purchase this office 365 uh, subscription you can install on five different devices okay so what does that mean five different devices so right now I'm using my desktop PC and my computer name is IT Howcast and everybody should know 
where is the computer name and just to give you a hint you right click on the start or click on start button or go to my computer or computer or this PC if you're using Windows 8 and Windows 10 right click and go to properties and under properties you can find it what's your computer name and my computer name is over here it's called idea Hawcast. this is my desktop PC and then this is this is you're seeing it over here this account is related to my desktop so if I have it my laptop or my I have it a tablet also I have a MacBook so if doesn't matter you can use it any browser and then go to this portal.office.com type it your username and password and then you're going to see your installer status you can see that you install on your uh, tablet you install it on your MacBook you have it on the laptop you have it on the desktop so you can install up to five different devices so let's say for example um, you planning to buy a new tablet or might be new MacBook or new laptop and this is your sixth device the sixth one and you want to install it so you need to go back to this website and then you need to make it your own decision hey I have it my old laptop I have it my old Mac or my old desktop sitting in a dust and you're not using it right so you find it in your list is go to the install status find it your your computer name and click on this deactivated deactivated button and as soon as you deactivate it that uh, subscription is going to deactivate it on that particular device and then you go back again portal.com portaloffice.com and you can install it the subscription you purchase might be last six months you can download on the new one once you download on the new one it's going to ask you again go ahead and do the activation all the step I just show you and activate it and you can go back again to this site portal.office.com and then make sure the new device is showing under install status okay so this is how you check your devices and uh, under this while I am on this uh, screen you can check your account information your personal information your subscription information other setting like themes and so on you can check on this one so this is all about how to check or how to activate activate office 365 uh, subscription on our Windows computer so hopefully you like it and you get an idea now so have a good day take care bye bye